So I'm back and we're taking a trip to Malaysia for a brand new action thriller that just got released on Netflix. So The Assistant is a brand new Malaysian film that just got released on Netflix. It's an action thriller. It follows the story of Zafiq, a man who was imprisoned unjustly and he bides his time and once he gets out, he goes about getting his revenge. He brings in the help of a bit of a crazy fella named Feroz or Ferez. I don't know, <laughs> I don't know how you want to pronounce it. The whole film is in Malay with English subtitles, so the pronunciation of some of the names definitely got beyond me. And so we have a pretty stock standard action thriller, like revenge tale. But that's not necessarily a bad thing. This movie definitely takes a lot from Western films. You can see a lot of influences throughout this movie, like a couple of the big ones that I noticed was probably Wrath of Man with uh, Jason Statham or Columbiana with Zoe Saldana. Both of those movies had really specific feelings and set pieces that this movie looks to have emulated a little bit. And this isn't a bad thing. It's really cool to see a country like Malaysia who isn't necessarily known for their big action thrillers to take on a film like this, to try and put this out to the world and be like, look, we can do it as well. You know, we can do it really well. And of course, any action thriller that comes from an Asian country is always going to get compared to The Raid or The Raid 2. I can say that this movie isn't quite as good as those two, but it still does a really, really good job. I thought the actors were really great. I thought the action was really good. I feel like the directing could have done with a little bit less, you know, confidence in itself, if that makes sense. I think there was a few directing choices where it was like, okay, just stay in your lane a little bit more and we'll enjoy the film a bit more because of that. They made a couple of choices where you were like, oh, I don't think they stuck the landing there. But overall, I think they all did a fantastic job. I think the writing was pretty solid. Like I said, the whole film is in Malay and I had to read English subtitles. I don't know who translated it, but the translation of the subtitles and the subtitles that I was reading, I could tell what was going on. There was no real plot holes throughout the film. I don't know if that's the same case in Malaysian or not, but... I thought the subtitles did a really good job, so that's why I'm gonna give The Assistant a seven out of 10. So tell me guys, has anybody watched The Assistant? If you have, comment down below, let me know what you thought about it. So yeah, after a couple of weeks off, I'm back. I've been a little bit busy with work and some other stuff, so I haven't had enough time to sit down and make some videos and watch some movies and, and edit it and put it out to you guys. But hopefully I'll get back on track and we'll be able to see some more movies. So that was the review guys. Hope you really enjoyed it. As always, click through to another video. We'll keep having some fun. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.